Hey guys, Valentine's Day is coming up. So instead of doing like a cute look with bright pink lips, I decided to go for something more subtle yet feminine this year. And this is a look that I've been loving lately. Even if you don't have a date, you can still look pretty and go out with all your single girlfriends. You might even meet your soulmate on that day. So let's get started. So this foundation, it has really great coverage with a natural finish. And I did get darker from Bali, so I need to buy a shade darker now for my foundations. So I'm just blending it in with a sponge. And then using a liquid concealer, just going to apply a little bit here to conceal my dark circles and also brighten up the area. Now if you have oily skin like I do, make sure to set your foundation with a pressed powder so that your skin looks good all day. I'm just applying this on. And then I like to shade my brows first using a gray brow pencil, a shade lighter than your hair color. And then I like to go in with a dark brown brow powder and then just fill them in. I love this product because it doesn't leave any harsh lines. And I haven't used this in a while, but I'm going to use this to line up my brows. Time for eyes. I'm going to apply this base color over my lid. And just blending it. Now using this gorgeous limited Gwen Stefani palette. I'm using this matte light tan shade and applying this all over the lid with a fluffy shadow brush to deepen the eyes. And then using this medium coffee brown shade, which is also matte, I'm applying this on the crease. And along the lower lash line, just the outer third. Taking this um, burgundy shade, I'm going to apply it on the outer corner and just blend it in nicely. You can use any matte burgundy shade. And if you have a small crease like I do, make sure to take the color up above the crease so that you can still see the color even when you open your eyes. Blend, blend, blend. Now taking this goldish brown shade and the charcoal shade right next to it, I'm just going to apply this on the outer crease to smoke out the look. And then with the burgundy shade again, I'm just going to line the outer corner of the lower lash line. Now I'm going to use this gel liner to line my eyes. It's going to draw a really thin line and also lining the waterline. It's super waterproof. I'm so going to wing it out just a bit. Now I'm just going to smoke out that line, blend it out to make it look more soft. Curling my lashes. Adding a coat of mascara. And since it's a special day, I'm going to apply some false lashes. And these are my favorite from Aritaum. I'm going to curl it all together once more. And adding another coat of mascara on the top and lower lashes. And this will help open up the eyes. And I like to use a black liquid liner to line the eyelash strip on top. Okay, so I love this contouring palette that I bought from Korea. I'm using the brown shade to contour my jawline and hairline. Oh, my hair is all over the place. On the sides of my cheekbones. Since they stick out a lot whenever I smile big. Now time for my favorite blush. I love the shade, it's very subtle, it's a very light peach shade. So 
just along the apples on my cheeks and then I'm just going to blend it to the side like upward now I'm going to take this highlight color from the same palette and I'm going to apply it to the high points of my face along here and on my nose bridge Now I'm going to take this brown shade again and then I'm going to contour my nose. I like to draw in the line first using a shadow brush. And then I'm going to blend it in lightly with a sponge. I'm just going to dab it so I don't mess up the foundation. Last is the lips. Using a new lip pencil to line my lips and also I'm going to fill it in. Using a liner will make your lipstick stay on longer throughout the day. And this is super matte. And then I'm topping it off with a nude lip stain. And this does have a little shimmer like when you swatch it on the hands but you can't see it on the lips. And eventually, it will turn into a matte finish. So here is the final look, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this look as much as I do. If you would like to see like a pink, cute, girly makeup next, let me know. And for the outfit, I think this dress from Lulu's is perfect to go out in. And also, my earrings are from Dantian Bold, which is perfect with this outfit. Also, make sure when you go out on a date, um, don't overdo your makeup. You know, do a look that you look comfortable and pretty and confident in. Sorry, I'm so sick. So, yeah, it's getting hot and the kids are awake now from their nap. Thanks for watching. Bye.